Hey, I'm here with Claire Larby, who since she graduated has gone on to do some really exciting work with London um, 2012. Claire, can you tell me what it is you're doing at the moment and how you got into it? Um, I'm working as Deputy Workforce Operations Manager, um, previously at Wimbledon for the Olympic Games and now at Eton Manor for the Paralympic Games. Um, and I got into it through um, when I was at London Youth Games, I met my future boss and um, she had an opening in the Young Games Maker programme which linked into what I'd been doing at London Youth Games, so that's how I got into LOCOG. Great, and what did you do at university and how did you end up getting here? Um, I did physical education um, and I knew I didn't really want to be a teacher so I kind of explored other options, did a bit of volunteering and sports development and then just by chance um, got an internship at London Youth Games and events and that kind of spiralled into the love of events. Okay, so that's really exciting. What um, skills and experience have you picked up since you've been working with London 2012? I suppose a bit of management because obviously I'm managing a team now um, as workforce operations uh, manager so that's great. Um, a bit more responsibility I suppose on site and um, a lot of kind of project management skills. And could you have expected doing this when you were at university doing your physical education course? Not at all. I think you just find your feet when you leave and find what you want to do. Great. And if you could go back to university and give some advice to all the young graduates looking for jobs and people who probably really want to be where you are right now, what would you say? Uh, definitely get involved in volunteering because that's really what um, got me the job with London Youth Games and then through that got me the job uh, at LOCOG. So definitely volunteering is the key. It gets you all the experience you need and then also you meet all the people that you might then get to job with. <laughs> Great. And what's been the most exciting part of your summer so far? Uh, I did meet Venus Williams, so that was very good. That was probably my highlight. <laughs> and so have you been able to take some time out to see the sport or have you just been too busy? I've seen a little bit on TV when I'm not being on shift, but we've been do doing long hours. But hopefully we finish tomorrow, so maybe on Sunday I'll get to see some. OK, is there going to be a big party when you finish? Oh, I hope so. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully a drink or two. OK, and are you looking ahead to other Olympic Games and other opportunities now? I'd love to go to Rio, that's definitely on my list of things to do, Rio and then maybe um, the Commonwealth Games after that, not Glasgow, but the next one. I think that's my next uh, opportunity, I reckon. That's great. Thank you very much, Claire.